So we think that Shepherdstown can in fact be the next um, community to support the arts and on a national level be a destination for artists to come to. The town became more diversified. I think the secret was out. A number of people decided, well, this would be a wonderful place to live, and they were right. It was a great place to live. When you were close enough to Washington, D.C., uh, you, could, you could hop in your car and you could be at the Kennedy Center in a matter of uh, 60, 75 minutes. Uh, there were a number of restaurants in Shepherdstown then, and to this day, there are still more restaurants in Shepherdstown than any town of its size that I know of. Shepherdstown is unique in that it can support uh, uh, more of that kind of thing than most, most towns can. Uh, unique uh, gift shops, uh, unique toy stores. Uh, it's just evolved into, a, again, a very, very special and very unique place. I was asked by Pam Parziali, who was West Virginia's Artist of the Year in 2005, if I could give an affordable housing talk. And during that discussion, an artist stood up and asked us, doesn't Shepherdstown love their artists anymore? Why is there no affordable housing? So that was the genesis of our idea for Town Run Commons. Town Run Commons is a creative community in Jefferson County. It's the first mixed use community ever approved in the area. And it's 32 condo flats with 20,000 square feet of commercial space, of which 10 is studio outer space and the remaining 10 is more retail which encompasses a local restaurant, homegrown homemade store, and a community kitchen. And the evolution of the whole concept has, has evolved to a sustainable market, um, both from an environmental standpoint when we talk about building materials, but also from an economic standpoint where we actually believe it's going to be an economic incubator, both for the creative class, but also for what's unique to our area, which is agricultural. We actually envision the environment or the homegrown homemade store um, creating a genesis for new businesses through value-added products. What people should be talking about on Town Run Common is that one is that they were able to visit the uh, Town Run Common, they had a great experience, they are able to meet artists that they would never been able to have access to any place else. In fact that we able to gave those artists the opportunity to be able to uh, build their product or to present their product in a uh, fashion that was not available to them in any other means. So Shepherdstown will become that destination that people will go to in the future. I, th I think the big piece in this whole um, economic development is to take an assessment of what local resources you have. So for instance, in Jefferson County, there's 139 nonprofits in what we'll call the arts and humanities arena. And we're leveraging what we have. We're trying not to uh, take something that we don't have and embed it. We're trying to leverage the local interest both from a heritage, historical, environmental, and ecological standpoint. <music>